Hello, long time no see. <laughs> so we were gonna make like a little update video um, regarding why we haven't uploaded in about a month, right? Mm -hmm. It's been almost exactly a month, I think. Um, and it's not, well it was by choice, but not preferred um, circumstances. Um, unfortunately, our last update was, I, I didn't even see what you said about the cancer thing. Oh, it was just an update of what was happening. What was happening. So, from that time until, what was it, what day was it? December 17th or something like yeah, that? Yeah, it was early Mid on. Mid-December. Um... Weston's dad started to get a lot of symptoms that his cancer was likely back and we had a lot of hope and optimism that it wasn't mm -hmm. and so um, after a few tests right they did tests they determined they that that it wasn't um, the better of the two options of what could be causing the symptoms um, and we just took, chose at that time where it was not important to spend time, um, uploading vlogs. We were still videotaping. We still have tons of footage. We do. Um. We ended up, um, doing a Santa video. Yes, we did. We still celebrated the holidays, mm -hmm. but it just wasn't the same. And it, honestly, I just didn't feel like it was anything I want to like go back and watch for a long time and we didn't feel like it really portrayed our family well it was just sad and kind of like blah like I don't know um so um so we had an appointment with the doctor the oncologist and he told us that the cancer did come back and well um, likely yeah likely on... didn't have exact proof but yeah they didn't actually test the areas but um that it was most likely that it was back and then that was a Thursday and then Friday happened and we just kind of had a feeling to go over and visit my parents and hang out with my dad and without um, the kids just us without the kids like we've never done and then <laughs> my parents house has uh, two stories and we ended up um setting his bed up on the first floor and um so he can stay there for you know so he didn't have to go long. up and down the stairs because yeah. their stairs are actually very steep he was getting house. really weak so um anyways we set him up and um then that morning early the next Saturday morning. morning um he went into the emergency room and um just went downhill from there yeah so Friday um, we just got a call well you got a call from your mom mm -hmm. um, that they were headed to the emergency room and we honestly I mean at least I did I honestly thought he was gonna get IV fluids he was dehydrated because we had seen him the night before and he was mm -hmm. very weak and we thought that's what it was because he was still like talking and you know everything but he just was really weak and that's where we learned that he was likely in the end stages of life which sucked bad like to put it lightly like that sucked yeah it was really and then, um, crappy we were there saturday and then sunday we ended up coming home that evening and on hospice on, care. On hospice care. And um, so for a whole 10 days with hospice, um, I was pretty much by his side every single day, all day long, uh, with the help of my mom and my sister. But um, I ended up staying with him pretty much the whole time. All night long. Yeah, didn't really get any rest or anything because I just was taking care of him, but um, that was tough. 
we were not vlogging any of this we were just taking all. time to comprehend what was happening because it was it was a shock i mean we knew he wasn't feeling well but we always kept the hope that it wasn't cancer because we never had any solid evidence that it was so we just you know i don't know processing the fact that this is really happening and it was just not something that and we couldn't even pretend that that wasn't happening or we couldn't even like there was nothing else to vlog because it was just all sadness <laughs> it was just sad yeah pancreatic cancer is not fun um very painful mm -hmm. um just not good but yeah. um so my dad did he he passed away um december 30th mm -hmm. and um yeah, I, no, yeah, I, know, I can't. There's, there's nothing more you can really say about it. It was really hard on everybody. It's. I think the hardest has been with the kids, for me at least. I mean, like, because I know Weston, like, knows our faith and knows what we believe in and knows that it'll be okay. But the kids can't fully grasp it and that's what's hard it's like they still ask for him they still don't understand where he's at so that's what i'm having a hard time with um like answering those types of questions that i'm not prepared so if you guys have any advice or any websites or anything that has like some good information of how explaining to like young children with our faith based in it because that's what we're trying to keep the kids like focused on not necessarily about the death but more so that they'll see him again and that he's um, not in pain anymore. Um, leave that down below because I'd appreciate that. I'm just really at a loss of how to answer some of these questions because they're they're very legitimate, good mm -hmm. questions. Very good questions. But I just don't know how to answer it in a way that a three-year-old or a seven-year-old is going to understand. So... We had the funeral it was on Friday. Friday, yeah. Was this Just a few days ago? Two days ago. And it was awesome. Um, it was, if you guys are friends with us on Facebook, I, as I'm friends with some of you guys on my personal page, then you might have seen a couple pictures we were tagged in. Um, it's an awesome service with like probably almost 300 people. Yeah, there's a lot of people. It was yeah. really cool. Service. Weston uh, had an amazing speech that everybody loved. He did really good, and he made a freaking awesome video. Which, is that live? No. Okay. I have to ask him. Yeah, we might put it up. Um, just for also so our family and stuff that was unable to attend um, can watch that also. And also just to have it for, like, our kids and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like, we want them to watch it. We don't want it... To we don't want to ever pretend that this didn't happen because we don't want them to forget him. So that will be nice because they do watch YouTube. They watch our channel like freely. We allow that. Um, and that might be something that sometimes they want to watch and we're okay with that. I I did hear that um, the audio was recorded during the ceremony. So um, I like to actually get the audio and then make a, a video. Kind of slideshow with the audio of my speech and then so you guys can like kind of see who my dad was and um how special he was to all of us uh and to me mostly um but it you know there's a lot of tears that was shed there's this whole month um has been a roller coaster it's been very emotional and um we just we're not emotionally there to uh, record or post any video so yeah um, it was not a very happy time in our house so uh, we do have footage though and we might put those vlogs up but if not we're gonna be starting today which um, we are actually at Disneyland mm -hmm. so we did a, took a really spontaneous trip where we just needed some sort of happiness like escape from like what reality is in our home right now just for a day just for a little bit 
so we surprised the kids we didn't tell them we told them we were going to Costco, which is really funny because they were hmm. equally as excited for Costco. Well, they were like so stoked on Costco. And you guys know we love Costco. So we got all the way to Disneyland and they're very excited. So um, it's gonna be a short trip, shorter than our normal trips, but yeah, it's, it's, something, it's something better than nothing, especially since actually our trip that was supposed to be in November, we canceled because that's when we kind of learned that things might not be well. For Weston's dad and we didn't want to be away in case something like that did happen and we didn't want to be three and a half hours away so it was really good that we canceled that we just kind of felt like there was too many reasons for us not to go huh things kept like mm -hmm. kind of popping up and we're like this is like not working out we shouldn't force this and the kids didn't even care huh they never even mentioned it no so that's why I also felt like they deserved to go for just a fun little trip because you know they were troopers they've been hanging through a lot of difficult days and they missed Weston so this would be nice for them to just have our attention and not at home with like different things that you know were pulling us but um so that's pretty much where we've been that's pretty much what we've been mm -hmm. doing and um yeah, and if um, if you guys don't know what pancreatic cancer is, you can go online and check it out and see how harsh it really is. Um, and if you want to donate um, for pancreatic cancer research, I'll put a link below. I think it's uh, pancan.org. Pan yeah. um, so we asked everyone that uh, attended the funeral to not uh, purchase or gift flowers but to donate um so um, hopefully we can find a, a cure for pancreatic cancer because it's been i i don't wish this upon anyone it is really really harsh and horrible 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 pain, so, very painful a lot of pain it is is so bad so hopefully um we can get some people to donate some money and help for that um so, yeah. So thanks for hanging with us, those of you that have been, you know, subscribed and kind of were wondering where we went, and we kind of left you guys hanging. It just this happened very suddenly. It was very fast. And um, I, I did leave a little update on one of the videos. Um, but I think it was the last video, and I don't know if many people saw it because I actually typed it from my personal account on accident. But whatever. Um, and if you're new welcome to our channel and i'm sorry that this is maybe the first video you're seeing but um we will be continuing to vlog every day so um i hope you guys continue to watch and stay tuned for a couple disney vlogs coming up and leave a comment down below let us know what you guys have been up to and yeah so is the disney thing gonna be after this i don't know what disney thing <laughs> the vlog from today. Oh, no. Okay. All right. So we will see you guys in our next vlog. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.